boiler explosions generally fell into two categories. The first is the breakage of the boiler barrel itself, through weakness, damage or excessive internal pressure, resulting in sudden discharge of steam over a wide area. Stress corrosion cracking at the lap joints was a common cause of early boiler explosions, probably caused by caustic embrittlement. The water used in boilers was not often closely controlled, and if acidic, could corrode the wrought iron boiler plates. Galvanic corrosion was an additional problem where copper and iron were in contact. The second type is the collapse of the firebox under steam pressure from the adjoining boiler. Releasing flames and hot gases into the cab. Boiler barrels could explode if the internal pressure became too high. To prevent this, safety valves were installed to release the pressure at a set level. The other common cause of explosions was internal corrosion which weakened the boiler barrel so that it could not withstand normal operating pressure. In particular, grooves could occur along horizontal seams below water level. Dozens of explosions resulted, but were eliminated by 1900 by the adoption of butt joints. Plus improved maintenance schedules and regular hydraulic testing. 